Yeah. Um, so this is once again, this is artistic. Um, Brother Isaiah, as you see, look kind of a little nappy, but it's all good. But I'm just going to jump straight in. Um, I just want to read the passage. And, you know, I think once again, shout out to the Most High. Um, shout out to Yahweh, um, you know, um, through Yahushua, um, the Messiah, Jesus Christ. Um, shout out to the brother Israelite, Shalom. Um, and um, just a beautiful thing. But I'm just going to jump this into the straight word right here. And um, pray may may this bring insight to our people, um, in general. So let's just go ahead and jump, just dive straight into this word, um, before we do anything. But second is Ezekiel. This is actually the book of the Apocrypha. If you brothers and sisters don't want that, don't know that. Shout out to the Torah lost tribes too, in the name of Yeshua. Um, and this is what it says. But um, just gonna quickly read it. So second Ezekiel. And this is basically the Lord will abandon Israel. Um, if you don't know here, so so it says this, it says um it, it, it's um that it said the Lord said it says Zadris chapter one verse twelve, I'm reading from the C E version, complimentary English version. Um it say the Lord said, Isaiah, tell the people that I, the Lord am saying, I I am the one who brought you through the Red Sea. And who made safe roads where there were, excuse me, where there were no roads at all? I appointed Moses as your leader and Aaron as your priest. I gave you flaming fire to light your way, and you watch as I did great things for you. But you have still forgotten me. I, the Lord, have spoken. I, the Lord, all powerful, also sent coils to show that I would take care of you. I provided you with camps where you could be safe, but all you did was complain. I destroyed your enemies and you re refuse to celebrate the, and honor me. All you ever done is grumble, grumble, my bad. Have you forgotten how many times I bless you with good things? Question. And when you were hungry and thirsty in the desert, do you remember that you said that you said to me, did you bring us out into the desert to kill us? Question. We would rather have stayed on as slaves in Egypt than to die out here. I felt sorry for you when I heard your moaning, so I gave you manna, the bread of angels, and you ate it. When you were thirsty, I spit open a rock, and all the water you needed flow out, and I gave you shade trees to protect you from the heat. I divided rich farmland among you, and enforced, enforced the Canaanites, the Perizzites, and the Philistines. What else could I have done for you? Question, I, the Lord, have spoken. When you were in the desert at stream stream of bitter water, you were thirsty and insulted me. But instead of punishing you with fire for what you said, I threw a piece of wood into the water and made it fit made it fit to drink. What should I do with you people of Israel and Judah? You refused to obey me, and so I will turn to other nations and make them my people, and they will obey my laws. You have abandoned me, now I will abandon you. I won't have pity on you, not even when you beg for it. I will no longer listen to your prayers. You have your hands are hence stained with blood because you are always eager to murder someone. You haven't just turned against me. You even turn against yourselves. I the Lord have spoken. And it says the Israel will be no Israel will be no longer. Let us just say, say this part one. Um, but yeah, you know, shout out to the Most High, to um, Yahweh, Yahweh, um, you know, and it's a blessing. And um, just want to tap into the um, tap into you know the the, the book of Psalms, um, Psalms, Psalms. It was actually in the new NKJV version. I'm getting different versions here, but it's only one word, so it's a blessing. Um, let's just go ahead and dive straight into it. Um, and this is the king, the, the, the king, and it's, that's not actually what I want to read. Yeah, salvation of the Lord. So the king shall have joy in your strength, O Lord. In Psalms, one, two, Psalms 21, NKJV. The king shall have joy in your strength, O Lord, and in your salvation, how greatly shall he rejoice. You have given him his heart's desire, have not withheld the request of his lips, Selah. So this is, you know, what we going through, um, God, you know, as God's people, um, a lot of us right now don't know that they don't have this 
this this this this knowledge uh, but once again I'm a piece of piece of crap you know because it's the most high who don't do things um, so please understand that you know we are God's people and we may be asking questions why are we always suffering why are we always being going through this hardship but the, but the answer to that question is because God's word clearly said we was once his people and the reason why he has turned, why we've been so wise, been so difficult for us, is personally because we done crazy things. And to this very day, the evidence is still there. The, you know, the murders, murder with one another. I mean, once again, we all part of 12 lost tribes. But, you know, and everyone has come from a different tribe. And that's why we have to go back and study our history. Don't just, you know, clearly read the Bible, clearly read the Bible. You know, read the word for the word, but also read it to have knowledge and understanding of your your history you know and history really is breaking down the words simply to say his story you know when you say when you watch tv basically it's saying tv tell me a vision tell me my vision so you know i'm a movie fan i like watching movies but in the end i know that's not my vision i can get some insight but that's not my vision um and i have to focus on what the king you know saying what 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 um yahweh yahweh want me to do for his kingdom, um, and in this, in this, in this, in this crazy, bizarre, crazy times, man, it's, stuff is real, you know, stuff hit the fan, um, but definitely, you know, just, this the truth, man, I don't know how to really tell it, nothing than what the word just said, I want to add it to the word, don't want to add, but we as people, man, and if you can, if you heard that word, and you, you can verify with that within yourself first, that's the first, but I didn't say it clearly, we, we go against ourselves, that's the worst, you know. But now we're in a new land, and hey, Caucasians, man, you know, I mean, you know, we in a land, man, and, and, and our people don't know this knowledge, you know, they don't know this truth. This truth is not known to their ears. It's ringing, but it's not clinging. So may, 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 may the most high be glorified, man. Straight up truth, man. The most high be glorified. So I just say I'm limited to this iPad um, time, far as I'm putting it on the video or internet, but yeah, may the most high be glorified, man. So shalom. Um, Shout out to you know the 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 the, 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 um, the brothers, the Israelites out there, and, and shout out to the you know just just believing God was revealed truth to whoever He has planned the Most High, and uh, shout out to Yeshua, shout out to the King of Kings, the Lord of Lords, and shout out to the King of Heaven, Most High. Be blessed. Um,